What's up guys, before I jump into how I feel about Wolfenstein Youngblood, first I'll show you my genuine reaction to the trailer, and then I'll come back here and I'll give all my thoughts on it. So, here's my reaction. Excited for this one. <clears throat> it's so much worse than I thought. We'll drive the Nazis out of Paris, just like Daddy did back home. No phone calls, no letters. Ooh, he's he just old. My agents inform me that he left the country under a false identity about four weeks ago. What the hell is this place? Music. Codename Blackbird. Very 80s. Paris Catacombs. That's your lead. He's in Paris. You know, if we say something, they aren't gonna do jack shit. Well, I guess it's just up to us then. Is that what's her name's daughter? I forgot her name. Let me show you the something. The Whoa. It's do or die. Just like Daddy told us. Uh, oh, so it's co-op. <laughs> you guys are weird. If BJ fucking Blaskowitz doesn't want to be found, no one Her on God's green earth that's gonna find his ass. We got this shit, sis. Fucking A. Have you ever killed Nazis before? We were born to kill Nazis. Yeah! Can we make it? How the fuck did I know? That's really funny. <laughs> wow, very 80s. I like it. It's like a Thor Ragnarok all over again. I really liked this trailer. Honestly, I'm surprised by all the thumbs down on YouTube. I get that they're making it a little more zany. It seems like with the second game, they really went overboard with all the jokes, all the comedy. But honestly, I think that's why I like the second game a lot more than the first one. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love the seriousness and grittiness of the first game. But the fact that they brought in all the characters and the comedy in the second one really kept me engaged. So I'm excited that Youngblood does more of that. So we're getting Billy Blazkowicz's kids, his twins, looks like we're going to be playing as them. There's a co-op game, which is really exciting. I was just talking about with my friend CJ the other day, how there isn't really enough co-op story focused games and this looks like it's going to be just that. I mean, if you've played the other Wolfenstein games, they are surprisingly very story heavy and very character driven, which is really awesome and it's one of the reasons why I love this series. Not only are we getting Billy's kids, but we're also getting Grace's daughter, who's around the same age, probably a year older, because as you know, she was just born in Wolfenstein 2 and Billy's wife was pregnant in Wolfenstein 2, so this is really cool that we're getting like the next generation of characters in the Wolfenstein universe. It looks like the funny jokes and the zany characters are still intact but honestly I was a little let down by how similar the daughter's personalities were they both like they seem really cool they seem like the, the hardcore badass chick for this trailer at least they seemed very similar but I'm hoping in the final game you get to know them better and then you find out they are different they do like clash a little bit so that's gonna be really exciting to see I'm just really excited for this game Wolfenstein 2 is on my like top five switch games like I absolutely love that game and I highly recommend it and it's so cool we're finally getting a third party AAA game day and day on the switch finally happening I'm curious to see how the switch version sells in comparison to the Xbox one and ps4 could it outsell the Xbox one version maybe you never know with a lot of third-party switch games they end up coming later so it's hard to compare sales because who would have bought the switch version if it would have been available at launch with all the other consoles probably a lot of people but they end up choosing another platform and that's not like they're gonna buy it twice when it comes to switch anyway I thought the trailer was awesome I love seeing them get their suits they're like exo suits I don't know what they are their personalities seem really cool although a little too similar hoping that's a little different and then the inclusion of Grace's daughter as well that looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun so that's all my thoughts on everything guys be sure to let me know what you think down in the comments section below do you plan on picking up Wolfenstein 2 and if so on what platform are you gonna buy it on switch let me know down in the comments I'll talk to you guys later